Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Myra from Low Carb Love. We just arrived at Olive Garden, which is an Italian restaurant, and I'm gonna show you how you can order low carb at pretty much any Italian restaurant. Now, before we get started, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and don't forget to turn your post notifications on so you don't miss any of my future videos. Let's go. Guys, I am so excited right now. This is one of the um, things that I start with here at Olive Garden. It's their salad, it's made with Italian dressing, it has the veggies, so it is completely low carb, and it's just great as an appetizer, and it's super light, so you don't get full for your big meal. I cannot wait to show you what I order. It is my favorite thing. I would order it even if I wasn't low carb. <laughs> So I'm gonna show you what I order, um, but I also wanted to show you other things that they have on the menu. So they do have like, they have things like salmon, they have shrimp, they have steak, um, and they used to carry the zoodles, which was amazing, but now they only have either broccoli or they do have a gluten-free option, which is a little better than your regular pasta, but it is not like low carb. So that's the only thing. So I'm gonna show you what I order right now, but um, these are some of the things on here. So this is how they, this is how they come. Which mm. mm. is like the best. I could eat the whole bowl. They also have the soup. It's a soup de Toscana. You can order that as well and just not eat the potatoes. I know it's like kind of a hassle, but if you're not in the mood for salad, at least you know that you can do that and it's pretty low carb. Even with the potatoes, it's still about 15 net carbs. So if you just kind of opt for not having them and kind of like picking around it or, or taking them out, you can still have a bowl, enjoy your soup, and it is still low carb. So just another option, but I love the salad. So that's one of my favorite things here. All right guys, so my food just got here. This is how it comes. Now, of course you can get the sauce poured all over and smothered all over the broccoli and the chicken. I like to order it on the side because I like to have control over it. It is a sauce that is made with cream and cheese, so it is very calorie dense. So I like to pour it over my, over my stuff. Now, if you don't care and you're like, I want all the sauce. It is low carb. You can totally do it. No problem. Um, but look at how beautiful this looks. I feel like it looks so fresh. You have the broccoli that's steamed. It's bright green. Then you have your grilled chicken. You can get um, the crispy chicken, but you want to go the grilled route because that doesn't have the coating that has bread, which would be higher in carbs. It's not gluten free. Anyway, and then I just do a little bit of Parmesan cheese and I cannot forget the spice. Guys, we need a little bit of spice in our life. So this meal right here is pretty much almost zero carbs with the exception of a few carbs from like the cheese and minor carbs that come in like a vegetable, like broccoli might have like two net carbs for the whole thing. So this is very, very low carb. And it's also nutritious, guys, because you are getting all that protein from the chicken and you get the nutrients from your veggies. So overall, I feel like this is the best choice, <laughs> not only because I absolutely love it, I just feel like it is um, a healthier option. What makes it more calorie dense is of course the sauce. This is very, very creamy, very hearty, and again, calorie dense. So I get it on the side so that I have control over it. But other than that, this here is a great option. I've tried the salmon. It's also good. I just, when I think Olive Garden, I'm thinking this is what I'm getting. If you guys haven't tried it, I think you should. If you have, comment down below, let me know um, what modifications you make when you come and eat here at Olive Garden or maybe some options that you have when you just go to a um, like a regular Italian restaurant. Because for the most part, if you go to an Italian restaurant, they're not gonna have zoodles, but they will have a broccoli or some type of veggie that you can do this same modification. As you can see, it is nice and rich and creamy. Guys, Alfredo sauce is one of the easiest sauces to make from scratch. It is a little bit of cream. Well, not a little bit, but it is cream, Parmesan, butter, and you end up having a deliciously thick and creamy sauce that is definitely low in carbs. Like this is probably one of the lowest um, carb sauces that you can get, but it just goes so well. Even with vegetables, you can pour it over salmon, you can pour it over shrimp, you can obviously pour it over chicken. I'm just a chicken person. I love chicken. I know it is. Some people are like, uh, oh, chicken's too bland for me. I just love it. And it's full of protein and it's lean because this is breast. And so you're getting um, a lean meat that is um, still has all that protein. So 
in my book it is a thumbs up so as you can tell this is pretty much the extent of the sauce that i use guys i swear this sauce is so thick and it's just so rich and flavorful that i feel like a little goes a long way this is more than enough for me i know some people are gonna like, oh, that's like nowhere nearly enough. Guys, at this point, it is too personal preference. You're gonna smother it or not use it at all or, you know, go halfway in between like me. Um, I do this and then just a little bit of chili flakes and I am good to go. So now I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy my lunch. <laughs> all right, so now my favorite part, eating. <laughs> I love food so much and this is literally like one of my favorite meals to eat out. It's just so good, guys. Trying to get like a really good bite here. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. You literally don't even miss the noodles or the pasta. Perfect textures, perfect flavor, all the protein. Guys, this is like a win. Seriously, it is a, in my book, 10 out of 10. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this. Keep snacking on my little, picking at my salad. You know, they give you like this huge, you know, like, I don't know, it feels like a big old container of salad. Um, and then whatever I don't finish, I take home. And then I'll have a little, a little snack. But yeah, right now I'm just gonna go ahead, have my lunch. This is definitely my biggest meal of the day. And um, yeah, I might have like a little snack later, but this is what I broke my fast with. It's, you know, really protein dense. It has a good amount of calories. It's gonna keep me full and feeling satiated for quite some time. And then at night, I mean, just might have a little something, but yeah, that's about it. All right, guys, so this is what I order low carb at Olive Garden. There are, of course, other options that are super yummy that I have not tried yet. If you've tried them, comment down below. Let me know which is the best. Um, but overall, you can still enjoy an experience with family and friends while you still stay low carb or like on your weight loss journey. But I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. If you guys are not subscribed to the channel, make sure you go subscribe and turn your post notifications on so you don't miss any videos just like like this. Guys, thanks so much for being here. I love you and I will see you on my next video. Mwah.